This is the SoCal Update. I'm Kara Santa Maria. An Anaheim family is on their way home after being trapped in Afghanistan. It's Wednesday, September 22nd. An Anaheim family that was trapped in Afghanistan after the government fell to the Taliban is on its way back to the U.S. They were on an evacuation flight that left Kabul Sunday night. KPCC's Leslie Berestein Rojas spoke with them after they landed safely in Qatar. So, Leslie, what can you tell us about their story? Well, the Kashefi family came to the U.S. as refugees in early 2017. Bashir Kashefi once worked as a translator for the U.S. military, and he and his wife Nasima traveled to Kabul in June to see relatives with their three young children. Their return flight was scheduled for August 20th, but five days earlier, the Taliban took control of Kabul and their flight was canceled. So what happened next? Well, they got in touch with the U.S. Embassy, but they couldn't find a way out. They went to the airport for nine days straight, but it was mobbed. And especially with their kids, it was just impossible to get on a plane. It was also very dangerous. At one point, gunshots were fired right near them. So they eventually gave up. And for the past month, they'd been staying with different friends and relatives, moving around pretty much in hiding. So how did they finally get on a flight out? Well, they'd been in touch with the State Department, and Bashir told me that he got a call from a U.S. official last weekend. They were told to report to a hotel near the airport. There had been some evacuation flights recently. That was the hope. He said they waited all day, then finally in the late afternoon, they were told, okay, you're on the passenger list. And Bashir told me that once they boarded that flight to Qatar Sunday night, it felt like a dream to them. They're they're still in disbelief. He told me they're going to be there a few days, and then hopefully by next week, they can come home. Thanks, Leslie. 